Imagine a shimmering metal sphere so dangerous it held the power to obliterate everything around it simply by being mishandled. Welcome to the spine-chilling saga of the Demon Core, a terrifying chapter in the history of nuclear science. In the midst of World War II, the ambitious Manhattan Project sought to harness nuclear energy, and at its heart was the Demon Core, an enigmatic subcritical mass of plutonium. Scientists like Harry Daglian and Louis Slotin dared to explore the lethal potential of this volatile metal, risking their lives in a bid to unlock its secrets. Working tirelessly, often with makeshift equipment, these scientists faced the ever-present danger of the core turning critical. Imagine being so close to a silent specter of death that just one misstep could unleash a fatal burst of neutron radiation. May 21, 1945, marked the first tragedy when Daglian accidentally triggered the core's wrath, a mistake that cost him his life 25 agonizing days later. Yet the true wake-up call, a bitter reminder of human fallibility, came one year later when Slotin's manual assembly plunged the core into supercriticality. He and others near him were hit by a wave of deadly radiation, leading to his demise nine days afterward. These heart-stopping incidents sent shockwaves through the scientific community underscoring the urgent need for rigorous safety protocols. The lessons learned reshaped nuclear safety measures, forever changing the way scientists interacted with radioactive materials. The Demon Core remains a stark reminder of the perilous dance between progress and caution, a testament to the thin line between genius and disaster. Its legacy endures, a haunting symbol of the sacrifices made and the essential balance between innovation and safety. If this story captivated you, stay tuned for more intriguing tales from the realm of nuclear science.